Signs of Labor You have likely gone into true labor if you've noticed the following signs, but always check with your practitioner to be sure. Strong, frequent contractions. You'll know you're experiencing actual labor contractions, rather than the practice Braxton Hicks contractions, by assessing the pain's frequency, intensity and location. If you're unsure, ask yourself these questions. Are the contractions evenly spaced? True labor contractions are spaced at regular intervals and become more frequent as time goes on. How long do the contractions last? Real labor contractions last for 30 to 70 seconds each. Are the contractions strong? Actual labor contractions get stronger over time and don't ease up, even when you change positions. You may not be able to walk or talk through labor contractions once they've progressed. Bloody show. You may notice the loss of your mucus plug, the cork sealing off your uterus from the outside world. It can come out in one large piece, it looks similar to the mucus in your nose, or lots of little ones, though you may not get a glimpse of it at all, and some women don't lose it before delivery. In the last days before labor, you'll likely see increased and or thickened vaginal discharge. This thickened, pinkish discharge is called bloody show and is a good indication that labor is imminent. Belly and lower back pain. You may feel like you're having strong menstrual cramps, stomach upset or lower abdominal pressure. You could also have pain in your lower back that radiates down into the legs. This pain won't go away if you change positions. Water breaking. While movies would have you think you'll learn you're in labor only when your water breaks, in the middle of a romantic dinner date at a busy restaurant, of course, that's a very unlikely scenario. For most women, membranes rupture and amniotic fluid leaks after other labor symptoms have already begun. And you won't necessarily lose it all in one big gush, either, for some women, water breaking feels more like a trickle. Your water breaking is actually one of the final signs of labor most women experience, and it happens naturally in only around 15% of births or fewer. So don't count on it as a definite sign of labor.